Hey guys, so today's video is going to be my monthly favorites video. I can't believe we're already heading into August. Like, I feel like July just flew by, but I've been loving a couple of new products this month that I want to share with you guys. So if you'd like to see what those products are, just keep on watching. So the first product I want to talk about is the First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream. This has completely saved my life. I have eczema, so I'm relatively dry, and this has just changed everything for me like whenever I feel like my skin is very irritated or I have a lot of dry patches I instantly gravitate towards this cream so basically it says it's for intense hydration for dry patch skin safe for sensitive skin as well and that is literally my skin all in one I have sensitive skin I am very dry and this has just changed the game for me so it leaves my skin really hydrated and really nourished I don't find that I have to reapply I find one application of this cream just gives me the perfect amount of hydration and covers all those dry patches and just gets to those areas that I find more dry than others so I've really really been loving this cream you could use it all over your body not specifically just on your face but you could use it on your arms if you have drier patches on your legs if you have drier patches but yeah I've been really really loving this cream for a while now and i'm happy to be sharing it with you guys knowing that if you have dry skin or if you have dry patches on your body this will really really work wonders so yeah this has really been something i've been loving for a while now so the next thing i want to talk about is this pharmacy honey potion renewing antioxidant hydrating mask i cannot say enough things about this mask i absolutely love it i don't know if you could if it's picking up much on camera but the way this works is so you just scoop out a good amount for your whole face and you rub it on your hands and you apply it to the face and once you start uh, massaging it into your skin the product starts to warm up so it might sound a little alarming but it's very soothing and and then eventually it'll turn into a cream this mask targets dryness dullness loss of elasticity uh, firmness and even texture after I re removed this mask from my skin my skin was instantly hydrated and more glowy it's literally potion for your skin and I love it I love it so the next thing I want to talk about is the IGK good behavior protein smoothing spray so basically um i received this in my boxy charm a couple months back and i have very very fine hair however i do have a lot of hair so it says that it's a keratin like treatment in a can 24 hour frizz control 450 degrees fahrenheit heat protectant i was a bit worried that this would kind of give off that um waxy waxy that's what i meant to say that you spray these in your hair sometimes your hair could feel like a bit waxy i did not find that with at all with this i actually really really love this so the way you use it is mist over damp hair or dry hair in sections comb through ensure every strand is coated so you blow dry and then you can finish with a flat iron for best results this just gets all my flyaways away it makes my hair look beautiful and silky and smooth and straight and it also smells delicious like if I could purchase this in a perfume scent I would it smells it smells so so good the next thing I want to talk about is a makeup brush it's from morphe and it is the morphe x Jacqueline Hill JH02 brush this is the bronzer blush and I've been absolutely loving this and it's supposed to be like a dupe for the Tom Ford bronzer brush which is like a hundred and something dollars this is like I think not even twenty dollars and it is just amazing the way that it's more tapered here and fluffy makes it that perfect bronzer brush that'll just sit perfectly in your cheekbones so the bristles are are also natural and yeah i've been really really loving this bronzer brush to apply my bronzer it's what i use today and every other day that i've been doing my makeup i absolutely love it okay so the next thing i want to talk about is a blush and i have been absolutely obsessed with this blush this is the Burt's Beads blush in toasted cinnamon if you can see that this is just like that perfect orange warm literally cinnamon color of a blush it's such a beautiful color it is a bit on the pricier side for a drugstore blush I think it's like $15 however the formula is impeccable it's so smooth and buttery and finely milled that it is just worth every penny like even if you don't even get this color or you get the ones that are more pink I promise you you will not be disappointed with this formula it is just amazing and I love it so much okay 
So the next thing I want to talk about is this Ilia bronzer from Sephora. This bronzer is just... I don't even know what it is about it that I love so much. I'm not sure if it's the formula, if it's the color, if it's like this really cute packaging. I absolutely love this bronzer. It is that perfect warm bronzer. It is not, it's not too orange. It's not too cool. It's not too muddy. It is just the perfect color bronzer. It gives like my skin that perfect bronze look and the formula is very very blendable it's smooth I have mine the color drawn in and I would definitely repurchase this oh, I absolutely love it I love it love it love it it is so good the next two things I want to talk about are lip products that I have completely fallen in love with and I love I've recently found two very very affordable um lip liners from the drugstore these are the essence soft contouring lip liners one is in the color lost in love and the other one is big proposal and i'll swatch them for you guys so this one here is big proposal and this one here is lost in love so i don't know if you could see that so big proposal is more of a mauve nude and this is more of a pink nude i'm not really a fan of wooden lip liners like the pencil bean wood because i just find it's a bit annoying to have to always sharpen them and i do find them sometimes to be a bit rough on the lips however they don't tug at your lips when applying them they glide on like butter and they are just amazing amazing lip liners they're not even three dollars and i absolutely love them when i went they didn't have any more colors these are the only ones if you could get your hands on these get them but the next thing i want to talk about are these lip glosses from the drugstore these are the maybelline lifter glosses I, i'm going to get more colors i only have three but i want them all i want them all they are so good they're infused with hyaluronic acid they are so pigmented so creamy so hydrating on the lips i absolutely love these and when i saw these at the pharmacy i was like a kid in the candy store i love them i love the packaging i the formula is exceptional these glosses kind of remind me of the fenty beauty gloss bombs in the sense of the texture and the formula these are super creamy and super pigmented so this one in fenty glow and this one from maybelline in the color stone they're very similar so this is fenty beauty and this is the one from maybelline and you can see that they're very very similar they're very similar in formula and texture like I, it hurts my heart to say this but i feel like i might love these a smidge more than the Fenty Beauty ones. I just find they're more hydrating. They last longer on the lips and they're a lot more pigmented. So I got three shades. I have one in Ice, in Reef, and in Stone. And I absolutely love them. They're so beautiful. They smell delicious. And the fact that they're infused with hyaluronic acid, I'm not going to sit here and lie and say that's not what made me buy them. But it is what made me buy them and I'm so happy I did because I absolutely love these. If you're a gloss girl, get your hands on these because you will love them. I promise. Also, they're supposed to be like plumpers. They're supposed to give you the illusion of lip fillers. But you don't get that tingly sensation at all, which I love because I hate plumpers that you feel like your lips are about to completely like fall off. I, I don't like that at all. These, they look, make my lips look super juicy and just glossy and beautiful without the effects of losing my lips. So I love that. I love these and I think that you guys should all give these a shot. So yeah, again, these are the Lifter Maybelline Glosses. Okay, we have one more thing to talk about and I'm really excited to talk about this actually because I've kind of like, I've kind of put it on the side to wait for my skincare um, video but I couldn't because I've just been loving it so much. And this is, it is a steamer from Amazon. It's a facial steamer that I purchased during quarantine. And I could, I could really thank TikTok for that because I've just, everything I've seen on TikTok, I've purchased on Amazon, this being one of them. And I do not regret this one at all. Um, if you're somebody who has very dry skin, who has a lot of blackheads, who has whiteheads, I would really suggest a steamer. So the, basically the way this works is this comes off, this right here, 
comes off you have a little pot down there a bowl that you fill with water to the max you snap this back on like so it comes with a it comes with a cup of water that you could fill the bowl to the max with and it comes with this little guide I guess that helps the steam blow directly into your face and you have two settings you you have one and two, one being less steam, two being more steam, obviously. I love this so much, especially when I find I'm having breakouts or if I'm getting a lot of blackheads in my nose area, my chin. I really get in there and I just let everything kind of soften on the skin because you've opened all your pores and everything is easily extractable. It's made such a difference in my pores, I find as well. So again, this is the steamer from Amazon that I will link in the bottom bar and I love it so much. So that's that. So yeah guys, those are all the products I've been loving in the month of July. I hope you enjoyed my favorites video and yeah, that completes this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in the next video. Bye! The benefits of this, it's for dryness. I absolutely love this bronzer br brush. Okay, I can't speak. Today, it is not for me. Today, I cannot speak. <sighs> okay. They're in formula and of the, and, high, and uh, they're very, so these are really creamier. So these ones are really creamy and really blendable.